Hi everyone, I'm Guillaume Bastier Rousseau and I'm an assistant professor at Southern Illinois University. I'm part of the Cooperative Wildlife Research Lab and the School of Biological Science. I did my master at Laval University in Quebec and my PhD at Trent University in Ontario. Clearly, I'm Canadian, I'm actually French Canadian, as you can tell by, uh, by my name and my accent. Before joining SIU, I was also a postdoc at the State University of New York in Syracuse and, a po and also at Colorado State University. Overall, my research group and I focus on spatial wildlife ecology. More specifically, we try to understand the cause and consequences of change in animal behavior and also how these change are impacting other species or the ecosystem. Like I said, we focus on spatial behavior and this includes animal movement and also habitat or resource selection. So basically what animals are, animals are needing to thrive in terms of habitat. Some of the work we do focus on predator-prey interactions. For example, trying to understand how prey and predators are moving in response to one another, or even how predator might be impacting prey populations. We are conducting research currently in Southern Illinois focusing on white-tailed deer, bobcat, and coyotes. Other work we do also try to understand why animals or even some individuals are doing specific movement. For example, long distance migration. We are conducting research currently on elk in Colorado in the Rockies Mountain and also, also on giant tortoises in the Galapagos, trying to understand, for example, why tortoises are going up and down volcanoes there. Most of the work we do focus on terrestrial species. Some of them are highly abundant, like deer here or even beavers, while other species are rarer or even sometimes endangered. We did work on caribou in Canada and also African elephants in northern Kenya. Our work is generally a mixture of doing field work outside and also spending time inside uh, analyzing the data. The ratio of both depends a bit of where you are in your career. I am myself spending less time inside than I used to. When we do field work, a lot of the work we do involve capturing or trapping animals to fit them with devices to track their movement. But we also do other field work, for example, vegetation or habitat surveys. When we capture animals, we normally use a GPS telemetry device to track their movement. For example, this is the type of GPS collars we use on white-tailed deer uh, around here currently. This little tracker is actually a tracker we use on beavers also around here, and we basically glue them on the back of the beaver. Lastly, this small tracker is a tracker we use on Galapagos giant tortoises. The nice thing with these trackers is that they are solar and also their battery life is actually quite amazing. We're able to track the movement of tortoises sometimes for up to 10 years. While doing that field work is often tedious, this is really only half the job. These trackers give us thousands and thousands of GPS, GPS location on, the animal, on animal movement. And so the challenge is also really about how to make sense of all that data. This is why a lot of what we do actually involves using computers and statistical or spatial uh, analysis to try to make sense of all that data. We use sometimes specialized software like geographic information systems, but a lot of the time what we're trying to get at is simply not inserable with the typical software. And so we end up having to design our own approaches, our own workflow, and this involves a lot of programming and scripting. So this is a brief overview of what we do in the Spatial Wildlife Ecology Lab at SIU. If you have any question, please feel free to visit our website. The link should be below the description of this video. And feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching and bye for now.